Hey friend, welcome back to another Adrian Graphics and Marketing tutorial. I wanted to make a tutorial today to show you how to use the text tool in Illustrator to make a circle, to make text around a circle. You may have never done this before, and if you haven't, this is the tutorial that you wanna watch. Without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and jump right into it because time is more precious than money. Let's jump in. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and make a circle. I got my document already set up here. I'm gonna go ahead and click and hold shift and drag. I'm gonna make a nice circle right there in the middle. Look at that. Okay, I'm gonna put that in here. I can hit the center button here, center, middle, there we go. Okay, now it's centered in my document. Okay, I got that here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a copy of it. So you're gonna hit Alt or Option. Go ahead and drag that down. Now I have two of them. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna take this top layer, I'm gonna turn it off. So now it's just a path. Let me say that again, one more time. It's just a path. So we're gonna go ahead and move this back up. Boom, right there where it lines up. And for just a moment, I wanna take this, and I wanna turn off this bottom layer, okay? On this top layer, I'm gonna transform, and I'm gonna make this just a little bit bigger. It doesn't have to be too much bigger, but just a little bit bigger, just to make the tutorial a little easier. So you can see the little link there, keep that turned on. 660. All right, so that's linked now. We'll get that transform tool on. All right, we're gonna turn this back on. You see that's just a little bit bigger. And let me just go ahead and line everything back up so you can hit this, align top, middle, front, back. Okay, it's aligned on every level now. All right, I'm gonna turn this off one more time and we'll bring that on here in just a minute. Now, if I want the text, let me select this. If I want the text to be on the inside of the circle, I'm gonna hold down Alt. I'm gonna do that regardless, but I'm gonna hit the my text tool. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna type out a word. So we're gonna type in Adrian graphics. There we go. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and center this. There we go, and you can see it's upside down. So I can go here, click off of there, hold down Shift, flip flops this to the top make this bigger okay now see how big those controls got okay so now i have this i'm going to go ahead and turn that circle back on i want it to be on the inside so i'm going to go ahead and hit transform bring this down oops there we go and i'll make this text white so it can be on the inside of that you can see here let me go back to transform okay we're going to go ahead and flip this back around Got it at the top. Now, if I need to create a second layer, maybe I want some text at the bottom, I hit Alt or Option, I'm gonna roll over that. Just bring it down a little bit. I'm gonna take this, grab this in here, boom. Bring this in here, and then if, if I need to, let's see, I can grab this guy and delete that one. And then in this one, I can make this just a little bit bigger. So what I want to do is I wanna make sure that the text, so this is 77.27, and then when I make this bigger, whoops. There we go, hit transform, make this bigger as well, because I want the alignment to be the same, so that's about right. But I need to make the 77.27 now. So let me go in here, there we go. So that font should be the same top and bottom. So Adrian Graphics Tutorials, right? So now I have the text at the top and I have the text at the bottom. Now I'm gonna adjust my kerning, hit Alt or Option. There we go. Do the same thing with this one, Alt or Option, bring it out. There we go. So this is circle text. Now, if you want to bring it to the outside, like this, some of these ones are the inside, you can do that. Like I said before, there's these little controls. You can see them when I roll over them. All I'm doing is roll, rolling over these. Let's see here if I can actually grab it. Make this a little bit bigger. There we go. You need to be able to see them. There we go. I can bring this in here. So that's how you bring it on the inside versus the outside. So these are the controls. And then if you need to adjust it for some reason, you can grab this little control right here. You can bring it to the left, you can bring it to the right. So this is the way that I use the text tool to actually make text inside of a circle. It's been super helpful for me and that's why I wanted to show this to you. So thank you guys so much for watching. I look forward to seeing you guys on the next video. And as always, keep looking up.